Welcome of UFC Unlimited Fight Channel. All right, coming up next, a UFC featherweight division fight. Every time out in the UFC, DC, this man has put on a striking clinic, and that is his methodology coming in here tonight. He'll try to keep the fight on. And that's why we tune in, right? That's why we tune in. We tune in to see guys that are dynamic. We tune in for the speed. We tune in for the knowledge of the striking game, the ability to set traps, the ability to find the jab, the ability to find the right hand, the right kick, the left kick, the knees, the elbows. He truly uses every weapon that he has in his arsenal to try and finish his opponent. You make one mistake, night's over. You cannot make mistakes against a guy that has the striking acumen yep. of this guy right here. And the jab is not as underutilized a weapon as it was in MMA, say, five or seven years ago, but he's got as good a jab as anyone in the business, and that is where all of his striking flows off of. We'll see how it goes for him in this matchup tonight. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique, because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. When the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Lavigne. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 136 pounds. El Diablo! And now, introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. They touch him up, and we are underway. Are you ready? Are you ready? All right, so here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a striking advantage on one side, but maybe not. This is a big-time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big-time athletes? Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Slips the punch. Or perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Now connects with a right. It's your defense. It's your defense now. Moving to his left now. Breaking down with a slow kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. Oh, nice jab to the head by Lee. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, 
He blocks the punch. Big call from punch land. Now he gets back to range. Over and over, he landed with big body kicks. Oh, you can feel that breeze octagon side after the swing and a miss by Lee. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Oh, Superman punch is good. You can tell he's been working on that. Just over three minutes now to go. Ooh, what a punch. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. Big kick lands. Oh, misses with the jet. Sneaky head kick. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Nice punch lands. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Defense there, huge block for him. Nice kick. Oh, he lands a straight punch there, DC. We'll see if he can follow it up now. He has been throwing the strike over and over again. Look how crisp and straight he is. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Been there at times, not that time. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Take him down. Oh, that's a good counter there. The straight punch lands by Lee. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Straight to the body there by Lee. 20 seconds now remain in the round. 15 seconds to go. Good stick. Ten seconds to go. Oh, and he caught the kick. Five minutes in the books. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are gonna be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're gonna see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets underway. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Can't take many of those, you better check. He loaded up there in that hard kick. Oh, 
Nice punch there by Lee. Look at him drive his shin into the opponent's body with that body kick. Another big body kick land. Lee going for the leg kick. He does not connect. Good defense to block the strike coming back. Big body kick land. Nice counter left there. Beautiful punch. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Landed that left hook. Back to the jab now, no good. Just over three minutes to go. Oh, and there's that head kick. He kept talking about the opening that would be there on Thursday. Those words proving prophetic right there. I mean, his vision and his timing allows him to get that technique off. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive. Oh! Back to the feet. Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Going for the leg kick, nothing doing there. Big kick land. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also gonna be able to land. He's gotta be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent starting to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Nice body kick. Oh, that's a nice strike. Couldn't have felt good as he lands the knee to the body. He's a tall fighter and he's going to have the size advantage against most opposition in this division. His hands are down. High kick, high kick. Ten seconds remain in round two. Nice leg kick. Oh, huge block. Two rounds in the books. All right, so that's the end of the round. Pretty significant damage done in that round. Cut on the cheek, sustained there from that strike. Now the cut man's got to get in there and close that thing up. Better to be below the eye than above it, sure. But nonetheless, this could be a factor now moving forward. All right, so there's the end of the round. Few things in MMA more devastating than a head kick and nearly produced a knockout for him there. We talked to him earlier in the week, and he talked about chances to take the kicks high. He got a chance, he took it,
He landed that kick and almost got the fight finished. Let's see if he can go and do that again. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them really picked it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. Ooh, blocks the shot. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Lee gets caught with that punch. Nice, sneaky head kick. And he comes through with a big knee. Oh, straight right. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Circling towards the left now. Stayed up I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up by much. Oh, straight right. And now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it. He's coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Able to check that kick as well. Just over three minutes to go. Move for me. Come on, keep those feet moving. Great punch landed with so much power. Right. Now he's on top of him looking for the finish. So inside the open guard of his opponent, you gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. A lot of top pressure being applied here as he works out of side control. Well, you gotta be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. And he continues to work the body here. Great upper body movement defensively, slips another strike there, and offensively, he hasn't been a world beater, but defensively, he's been strong tonight. And that has to cause frustration for the opponent, not being able to hit a guy that you want to really put away. But that's a testament to the head movement and the activity and the awareness of this fighter defensively. Oh, man, this guy kicks like a mule. So hard, he kicks so hard, every time you can see him drive his shin into his opponent. Oh, man. Oh. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the judges out of it. He is lighting them up now. Head kick is blocked, so no damage inflicted there. Throwing that jab, no good. Beautiful strike. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Well placed kick there by Lee. Head kick. Oh, a huge block there. A nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. Oh. Back to the feet. Uh. 
there's no tell on that leg kick. Oh, spinning back has got a run around. All right, that's the end of the round. He's got a cut on his cheek from that round. There are certainly worse locations for a cut on the cheek. It's not going to trickle down into the eye. Nonetheless, pretty significant gash. We'll see if the cut man can close it up. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Blocks the shot. Big body kick. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any... Oh! He's hurt. He's hurt bad. Here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Put your hands up oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Looking to land the right just out of range. Look at him flip his hip into that kick. Just misses with the jab. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Oh, he found the target there. That'll work. Under three minutes remain in round four. Huge block there. Liver kick. Just unable to... Oh, he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, got him! He got him! Well, not good body language from his opponent here, DC. He's curled up. No, he's exhausted. He's been beaten. Oh! All right, inside his opponent's guard here, DC. You don't want to play around here too long. No, you got to either have two hands in or two hands out. Our guys start to attack triangles. Oh, and he lands another huge knee there as the taller fighter uses his length well yet again. be a short night for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. So there he is as the celebration continues. A huge knockout for him here tonight. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, the referee Eve Levine has going to stop for this contest. At three minutes, 14 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. 
there is the man of the moment, and what a moment this must be like for a professional athlete, right? I know you enjoyed the birth of your kids, right? Yeah. But you knock out a man in a cage fight, I can't think of anything better. I mean, there's nothing like it. You know, you don't even hear the one that lands, that puts out your opponent's lights. And tonight, he got that done. And he should be very proud.